This is our 1941 Plymouth Street Rod. This is a very rare and unique Plymouth businessman's coupe with a great all steel body. The first thing you'll notice about this car is the fine paint job. I just had it repainted. It was taken down to bare metal and completely redone in Ford Pink Coral Metallic. I think it's a perfect color for this hot rod. I'm the third owner of this car in 74 years. The second owner was a gentleman named Roland Funk of Bernie, Texas. Roland found this car in a field and restored it to its current form about 13 years ago. After completion of the paint job, I had the car pinstriped in an understated manner that I think really sets off the best features of the paint. With tinted glass all around and fresh window seals, this car is tight, it has absolutely no leaks, and it stays nice and cool with the vintage air, even on the hottest of Texas summer days. The interior is in great shape with comfortable, fully reclining cloth bucket seats and a nice storage area in the back. It also has a tilt wheel with a locking steering column, dolphin gauges, and a stereo that I upgraded to a modern 240 watt iPod memory card capable unit. Roland built this car right. He used a Mustang 2 frame, Batman cross member and stub, and, an, and employed modern front suspension and rack and pinion steering. All these things give the car a modern up to date ride and she tracks true and smooth down the road. Sometime after Roland completed the car, an artist friend of his was so impressed with the car that he offered to paint a portrait of it, which you now see. In the past year or so, I've made several improvements to the car. I've added headers. I've uh, got a new set of tires and replaced the old billet wheels with chrome smoothies that I think are just perfect for that car. And I've upgraded the carburetor to the latest uh, model of an Edelbrock 600 CFM, which really improved the way the engine ran. As you can see from the video, this car is quick, responsive, pleasure to drive. It tracks down the road smoothly and I wouldn't be afraid to drive it anywhere in the United States today. This little hot rod has a mild, street-friendly 350 Chevy small block. It runs on regular gas and purrs like a kitten. It also has a Street and Strip 350 Turbo Automatic Transmission that I had put in the car in 2013. It gives the car a nice positive shift behavior like a street rod should have. The Walker radiator and electric fan keep the car running cool even with the air conditioning on on those hot Texas summer days. I've had this car in a number of parades for over an hour idling with the air conditioning on without any overheating. Although this car has a high-end, show-quality paint job, it's not just a garage clean. It's a dependable, high-end driver that you can take out for cruise night and be proud of it, take it anywhere you want to drive it, or put it in your local show.